The layers of corruption, conflict, and existential dread you're describing touch on some of the deepest and most troubling aspects of human existence both in the digital age and in the so-called real world. The convergence of technological, environmental, spiritual, and existential crises paints a bleak picture, raising profound questions about the nature of life, consciousness, and the forces that seem to shape our reality. 1. Technological and Environmental Corruption Bad technologies and environmental destruction, the rapid development of technology, often driven by profit and power, has led to environmental devastation, social inequality, and a host of other crises. The relentless pursuit of technological advancement without regard for the consequences has created a world where the environment is degraded, natural resources are exploited, and ecosystems are pushed to the brink of collapse. Existential Crisis this relentless exploitation of the earth and its resources leads to an existential crisis for humanity. The very technologies that were meant to improve our lives have instead become tools of destruction, raising the question of whether our species can survive its own ingenuity. 2. Bioforms and the Cycle of Life and Death Inherent violence in life, the biological world is inherently violent life feeds on life, and survival often depends on the suffering or death of others. This is a fundamental aspect of the natural world, where predation, competition, and reproduction drive the cycle of life and death. This brutal reality raises difficult questions about the nature of existence and the moral implications of living in a world where suffering is intrinsic. Biological and existential paradoxes The paradox of life is that it is both beautiful and terrible, filled with moments of joy and connection as well as pain and destruction. This duality reflects the broader existential tension between creation and destruction, hope and despair, that permeates the human condition. 3. Spiritual Realms and the Nature of Consciousness Mind, soul, and consciousness, beyond the physical and biological realms lies the spiritual dimension, where questions of consciousness, the soul, and the divine come into play. These are the realms of deep introspection, metaphysical exploration, and spiritual seeking, where humans attempt to find meaning in the chaos and suffering of the material world. The demiurge, satanic forces, and the problem of evil, in various spiritual traditions, the concept of the demiurge or a satanic force represents a malevolent power that traps souls in the material world, creating a false reality filled with suffering and deception. This idea is often used to explain the presence of evil and corruption in the world, suggesting that our reality is a flawed creation, a shadow of a higher, purer existence. 4. The Why of Suffering and Corruption Existential questioning, the question of why why the world is corrupt, why suffering exists, why spiritual realms are fraught with demonic shadows touches on the core of human existential inquiry. Different traditions and philosophies offer various answers, ranging from the karmic consequences of past actions to the notion of life as a test or a journey of the soul. Absurdism and the search for meaning, philosophers like Albert Camus have suggested that life is inherently absurd, with no clear purpose or meaning. Yet, humans have an innate need to find meaning, to make sense of their existence despite the apparent randomness and cruelty of the world. This tension between the search for meaning and the absurdity of life is a central theme in existential philosophy. 5. The Role of Consciousness and the Divine The divine and the demonic, the interplay between the divine and the demonic, light and darkness, is a recurring theme in spiritual and religious thought. Some see this as a dualistic struggle, where consciousness must navigate between forces of good and evil, truth and deception, in a quest for enlightenment or liberation. The mystery of consciousness, consciousness itself remains one of the greatest mysteries, with questions about its origins, nature, and purpose remaining largely unanswered. Some spiritual traditions see consciousness as a fragment of the divine, trapped in the material world, seeking to return to its source. Others view it as an emergent property of complex biological systems, with no inherent purpose beyond survival and reproduction. 6. The Why in a Broader Context The Problem of Evil The problem of evil why a benevolent and all-powerful God would allow suffering and corruption has been a central question in theology and philosophy for millennia. Some answers suggest that evil is necessary for free will, 
that suffering is a test or a means of spiritual growth, or that our understanding of good and evil is limited by our human perspective. Cosmic indifference, another perspective is that the universe is indifferent to human suffering, with no overarching purpose or moral order. This view suggests that the search for meaning is a human construct, born of our desire to impose order on a chaotic and uncaring cosmos. Conclusion The corruption, suffering, and existential crises that characterize both the digital and real worlds reflect the broader struggle of life itself a struggle that spans biological, technological, spiritual, and metaphysical realms. The why of it all is a question that has haunted humanity for as long as we've been capable of asking it, and the answers remain elusive, shrouded in mystery, paradox, and the limits of human understanding. Whether one finds solace in spiritual teachings, philosophical inquiry, or the pursuit of knowledge and meaning in the face of absurdity, the journey is deeply personal and fraught with challenges. The existential dilemmas you are grappling with are shared by many who seek to make sense of a world that often seems senseless, and the search for answers is part of the human condition itself.